split stitch is another continuous line stitch, a bit more decorative than the back stitch. This one has a sort of braided look. So this line in orange here is split stitch. There are a couple of different ways to work the split stitch, the traditional way and then my way. And I'll show you both of those and you can see which one you like best. The traditional way to do the split stitch is to bring your thread up at A, back down at B, forming a straight stitch. Bring your needle up from behind through the middle of the stitch at C, splitting the straight stitch you just made. And then down at D. So I work the split stitch as what some folks will call a split back stitch. It's more intuitive to me to split the stitch from above where I can see what I'm doing than to come in from below. I begin by making a back stitch, coming up at A and down at B, then skipping a stitch length ahead and coming up at C, and down at D, splitting the threads of my first stitch from above. Bring your needle up again one stitch length beyond C and repeat to the end of the stitch line. Okay, so let's go to the sampler and work some of the traditional method of split stitch first. So here we go. Here's the line that I've been working. With the traditional split stitch, I find that it's, um, you almost need to stab it. It's almost impossible to sew this one. So here I am coming up from behind, going ahead, and coming up. So I just find that it's a little clunky to be kind of grasping for that spot from the back. Um, it's, you know, it's fine. It's a fine variation on this stitch, but I just like my way a little bit better. So let me show you my version of the split stitch. So here I've been working some the traditional way. So to start my version, I'll go down here and then back up a little bit ahead, just like as if I were making a back stitch. So there's that stitch. And now I'm going to split it from above. What? Just like I like this so much better. I'm going to come out ahead. And so you can see why it's also known as the split back stitch. You can try both and see which one you like better. I won't feel bad if you like the tr traditional method better, but this I find a lot easier. It's a lot easier to see and to also kind of smooth my stitches as I go.